your eyewitness weather forecast. Good evening, everyone. I'm meteorologist Craig Flint. Uh, as expected, definitely feels a little bit more like August out there today as uh, we've gotten a little bit more in the way of humidity and there have been a few showers and thunder showers kind of around us here. So really not much going on locally right now. That's downtown in the arterial 81 over 61. That's the dew point. So it's a little bit more noticeable. Uh, and as we go through the overnight hours, uh, it's mild and muggy. There could be an isolated shower or thunder shower here or there. Uh, nothing too concentrated at a low of uh, 64. Tomorrow, different story. Becoming breezy with downpours and storms developing by lunchtime and then into the afternoon. And a couple of these storms, I think, could have gusty wind and some hail. The highest likelihood is south and east of Utica. We'll take a look at that in a moment. All right, here's a look at what's going on right now. We had some thunderstorms fire up over the capital region. One lone guy over Fulton County right now. Uh, and then, like I said, locally, not much going on. That shower near Gloversville, but you can see here through the Mohawk Valley, it's dry. North of the international border, though, we have this line of thunderstorms. Uh, you can see the lightning increasing here across uh, southern Canada. Uh, and this is all going to kind of shift its way to the south and east. So uh, I think most of this will weaken with the setting sun, but there could be an isolated shower or thunderstorm overnight. Then the severe risk on Friday. It's especially to the south and east. Uh, more specifics on that here uh, shortly, but we're still on track for a wonderful weekend. It looks good, warm sunshine, uh, low humidity as well. Temperatures will be near 80 uh, both days. 78 now in Utica, 77 in Marcy, 74 Cooperstown, Springfield. And up north, we've had a few showers, so temperatures right around 70 Blue Mountain Lake to Indian Lake. Here's a look at satellite Doppler radar. A few showers now pushing into far eastern New York and New England. And then this cluster north of Lake Ontario and over Lake Huron. We'll be watching that for uh, later uh, tonight. All right, let's kind of hone in on the severe threat tomorrow. So there is a risk for a few storms here tomorrow to have some damaging wind gusts, frequent lightning, and maybe some small hail. The highest likelihood is in this yellow shade area. So that's basically in a line from Utica, Rome to points south and east. So southern Herkimer County into Otsego County. Eyes on you guys tomorrow. Now that doesn't mean that areas to the north and west won't have a gusty thunderstorm. All this means is the highest likelihood is to the south and east. You'll see that as we go through the uh, afternoon here. So a couple showers overnight and then through the day tomorrow, partly sunny with showers and thunderstorms developing by midday and into the afternoon and again they kind of line up south and east of town that's where some of them could get a little raucous we'll keep you posted and then it uh, clears out here as we go into the weekend so 78 with gusty storms tomorrow to the south and east wonderful weather saturday sunshine near 80 sunday mostly sunny clouds increase late but another nice day 82. Yet again on Monday, another round of strong to severe weather could linger into Tuesday, windy. It turns slightly cooler, less humid, highs in the upper 70s. Uh, and then we go into Wednesday and Thursday, uh, warms up, highs low to mid 80s, maybe an isolated thunderstorm by Thursday. Jamie, over to you.